Welcome to Midway Power Sports, also known as MidwayPowerSports.com, located here in the heart of the Ozarks in Spokane, Missouri. Folks, we're just about uh, 20 minutes south of Springfield, 30 minutes northwest of Branson, Missouri. And today I'm featuring a quick video here on a 2006 Dodge Ram 2500. This is the Bighorn Edition Crew Cab Short Bed 4-Wheel Drive, powered by the uh, 5.9 liter high output Cummins turbo diesel. Folks, we do these videos simply out of courtesy. I'm sure, it's a lot nicer than seeing uh, still photos for you at home shoppers. Allows you an opportunity to see the sights and the sounds and, uh, of all of our uh, vehicles. And we will end up taking it uh, for a quick spin down the road. Just bear with me, I'm going to walk around the truck, I'm going to talk a lot and try to point out anything that's maybe hard to see and that I feel is hard to see in the pictures and videos. Do you have a, if I remember correctly, it's a clean history report uh, on this truck. Do you have those in hand? Uh, first thing I want to point out is the chrome is all nice on this grill. These Dodges and toys for the chrome starting to peel. Nice chrome, nice chrome on the front bumpers. It does have a set, a uh, matching set of Nit Nitto uh, Terry Grappler All Terrain. Good tread, front and back. This truck's not showing the rust. It does have a few flaws, I remember, and I will be sure to point them out. Minor, minor flaws, especially on a pre-owned truck, folks. But this it doesn't have a, doesn't have the rust rockers and, and cab corners and everything's nice and solid as I go down the bedside here you can see where there may be just a tiny few light scratches and we've got a little little uh, paint chips right there just a few tiny tiny little deals and his back these tires have got good tread on them as I go along the, the back the the rear bumper just looks brand new. No dings or anything there. Got a little uh, chip in the tail light right here. Uh, doesn't hold water. Tail light's fine. Uh, nothing, nothing wrong with it there. Of course, you got your normal wear light scratches there. Have a little scratch right here. Do my best to film this and show it all, folks. Another little one right there. Alright, without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and open this truck up, start looking at a few things. So you have the flip up seats for storage, they do that on both sides, you know, see my pictures, I do all that. You do have the sliding back glass. Interior's in really nice shape. Power windows, power locks, uh, power mirrors, uh, and the, the mirrors are heated. Six-way power driver's seat. Driver's seat's really in excellent shape. Flip-up console lid. Of course, all this function, functions just like it should. Got two little holes if you see them in the... Two little spots in the passenger seat here. Just to point everything out. Really minor stuff, folks. The truck does not smell like cigarette smoke. Um, nothing like that. Nice, nice, clean smelling truck. Um, it's not just from us cleaning it. We, we didn't cover anything up there. Um, go ahead and hop in it here real quick. I am going to be test driving this truck with 150,459 miles. My steering will adjust it up here. my seat belt here real quick see there are no lights on the dash this is a cold start cruise control uh, automatic lights four-wheel drive 
ice cold AC and get it turned on there and get it going. There we go. There we are. Uh, radio. Turn that off for a moment. Of course, your windows go up and down just like they're supposed to. Power mirror here on the driver's side. Power mirror there on the passenger side. There we are. liter Cummins Turbo Diesel. Excellent shape. Guys, I pulled that oil cap for you that, that don't know. I'm showing you that the truck does not have any blow-by. This truck's been maintained very well. It does have aftermarket exhaust. So this truck does have aftermarket exhaust, straight pipe exhaust. Allows it to, to breathe and... and uh, motor breathe a little better, get a little bit better fuel mileage. There we go, we got the AC going. Um, but I pulled that oil cap to show you that there is no blow-by uh, and that this truck is in excellent shape. I'm going to go ahead and take this uh, window sticker down. We've got it on the lot for a special 21.4. As is with no warranty included, we do offer uh, aftermarket warranties available. And show you that the wipers work there. There's the horn. We'll take this thing for a quick drive down the down the highway. And that was a, a cold start there. No smoke. No, you know, it fires right up just like it's supposed to. Folks, that was just normal acceleration up to highway speed here. As you can see, I'm not hanging on to the steering wheel. Let go of the wheel there. Nice and straight down the highway. There's no shimmies, no shakes. No air noise. You know, I've got the air AC on. There's no wind noise coming in through the doors. Man, this AC is ice cold. I've got that vent pointing on my stomach right now and it's freezing me out. Hot, hot day out here. It's hitting, the uh, truck's showing 84. But I just heard on the, uh, I don't know if that's focusing in or not. Truck's showing 84, but I just heard on the radio it's supposed to hit 90. 90 and a humid day out, so definitely want some ice cold AC. Folks, get, check us out at MidwayPowerSports.com. You can reach me at 417-443-2300. Uh, but there's no shimmies, no shakes. Nice shifting there. As I hit the brakes, nice firm brake pedal. Go ahead and lean on it here a little bit for you. Again, nice, uh, nice firm uh, brake pedal. No shimmies, no shakes. Uh, the brake pedal wasn't spongy. It was nice and firm. Shifting great. Nice cold start, nice acceleration.
travels nice and straight down the highway. I'm just catching a couple of turn lanes here. I got to swerve around here. All right, folks, that's going to conclude my video. Hope you enjoyed it. Again, this is Midway Power Sports, midwaypowersports.com, 417-443-2300. This is our 2006 Dodge Ram 2500 4x4 uh, quad cab or some call crew cab short bed, which is the full four-door. Uh, this is an SLT Bighorn with 150,000 miles with the 5.9 liter Cummins diesel. Folks, feel free to give us a call and check us out. Thank you.